Hello everyone, this is GrayShot170 here bringing you another episode of our Hearts of Iron 4, the Great War series as the Balkan League. This Balkan League is slowly having issues. A, we're having trouble fighting people because we claimed everything in our area, so now we have to go into Europe. That's going to be fun. The Soviet Union is on the verge of collapse. I believe they're at 82% or something. Uh, 81 still. And worst of all, I ate all my chocolate. I mean, this is horrible. No more snacks. Yeah, it looks they like the not. Allies are coming in, taking out Tiflis. Yeah, actually, yeah, it's just been a, some could say a cakewalk, haha, <laughs> for the Allies right now. Because they're just moving through the Soviet Union like nothing. If the Germans were this successful in their attack, the Soviet Union would have capitulated. Yeah. Anyway, our goal is to take out Romania, me and Bulgaria. So, and if you don't know, hey, why take Romania? If you look at their uh, resources they have, I could use a lot of this. So, that is why. My brother could also use it, as we can double-check his resources. He's kind of down mm -hmm. on some things, so he's importing a lot. Same thing like me. So if I can get that, it'll work out for the both of us really, really well. Long-term plans is Greece is going to attack Italy. That's my long-term plan. Yes, I'm going to invade Italy. If you have a problem with that, let me know. Also, <laughs> But I'm sticking to it. Yeah. Also, Spain might be something I'm looking into, but as you can see, it's being guarded by the UK at the moment. Hopefully, a fascist regime pops up and is like, hey, what's up, and takes over the country. One can only hope. Well, right now, the communists are 41% in control of the uh, French. Oh, right. Yugoslavia, here's another fascist boost. Yeah, what's up? Oh, thanks, fam. I will try. We are trying to get Yavert fascist so that way he can assist and leave the Entente on fascist terms. Wait, 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 wait. Should I be boosting Yavert communism? No, because that won't help. That will... Uh, that'll just make his party bigger and my party smaller. Okay. So, I'm, I'm yeah. just making sure. Yeah, let's just... Let's let's just... Let's just focus on the popularity of the ultranationalists. Thank you. Actually, Yavert... Has anyone even gotten a bonus? Like, I think you actually have to get them over that threshold. I got them at 32%, alright? Oh, really? Okay, I so think Yavert... I have to give him the majority party. Which I'm doing. And right now, the popular Democrats are going down. They're at 51%. We have 32% for the oh, wow. fascists. So hopefully... The Coxons are just getting swarmed. It literally is they are charging... Actually, let me check the losses. Wait. Are, this, are, are the Allies winning? Or are the Soviets counterattacking? What are you talking about? Kind of looks like the Soviets may be counterattacking a little bit. No, but... they're just getting cut up. I love this. It's like, oh, a million men. That's not too bad. And then you jump over to the other one. It's like, oh, six million dead. Plus the other one, seven million for the mm -hmm. Soviet Union. There's once they lot. take over, once they take over this caucus in area, it's just the capital that's left. They literally, which I'm sure they're fighting valiantly for, and it, because it's the mountains, it's it incredibly, it's a lot worse for them. Yeah. Actually, now thinking about this, the Soviet Union was doomed from the start. And why is that? Because they started too early. No, because they lost the first war. If you, yes, they have a lot of industry, but all of their like their resources, like um, like their equipment, all that kind of stuff was shipped over to Germany and Austro-Hungary when the war ended. That is true. And then that was shipped over to the Allies. So basically, the Russians gave the guns they would be using in this war to the people they're fighting right now. I mean, they weren't... Yeah, you're not wrong. Oh, God. It's basically like if the United States gave, like, half their guns to Germany and then attacked them. It's like, uh, <laughs> I don't think we would have been as success successful. Successful, yeah. Yeah. On the counterpoint, though, they just took the new capital, and they're up to, what, 84? Oh, wow, 84%. What's the new capital, then? Oh, my God, Tashkent. Three victory points. Are you serious? They're so close? Yep, they're Damn still... It. They're they 84%. Have... <laughs> yeah, I this I don't think they'll have to worry too much. This will be just moving Where's inwards. the other one? Tashkent. It's in the middle of... Uh, it's like in Kazakhstan. Modern day. Maybe uh, Kazakhstan, uh, Tajikistan, uh, Oh my god, like there? Earth 5, yeah. Three victory... Oh my god, that is... So stupid. It is. So on the but on the bright side, that that'll distract the allies a whole bunch. 
So it's going to be a long, arduous war for them. And the more they lose their population, the better we're going to be. Yeah. Because, again, this whole idea is the Balkan League. These three tiny little states. I just states. passed 125, just letting you know. Oh, it's doing it now. Let's get a maintenance company for my armor that I will be building soon. Actually, how's the research on the planes? The planes are done. I want to say they're done, right? They are They are done. The, the tri Okay, triplane's good. 15%. How's... Yeah, <laughs> nearly three... Nearly, like, ten years on that one. Alright, so let's start producing naval bombers. Oh god, their army's showing up on my border. Oh, lovely. Can I modify the... seaplane? Is that, is that possible? Uh, I could. Cool. So let's, uh, well, get let's see. How many men... How many men have now on my border? I now have... 69 divisions, 70 divisions, 80 divisions. Uh, maybe reliability would be good. Rip you. Where's the... The young talk's coming after fascists. I'm not fascist. You're fascist. Oh. No, I'm not fascist yet. I'm still... <laughs> oh, <laughs> my God. I'm not fascist yet. He's like 33%. Where's the where's the ultranationalist like missionaries or something that pops up in your country? God dang. There. Like yo, we're not still happening. Hiding, fam. Damn, yo, when I hit twenty percent they pop up on mine. <laughs> I feel like once Russia capitulates, I feel like the world tension will like shoot up to where it is supposed to be. I feel wait. like that's not <laughs> Uh wait, 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 wait. So if I click on yours, do you have anything? No, you don't. Damn it. I was like, I got so excited. I'm like, wait a second. Maybe if I'm, I was looking in the wrong area, he does have it. Nope. Nope, he's just gonna disappoint. Sorry. Tend to be really good at that from what I heard. Well, actually, bro, if you could do me a favor. If you attack first, you'll draw a lot of Romanians off my border. Oh, great. I'm happy to be the scapegoat for you. You're welcome. Uh -huh. But no, I, then I can maybe push up a little bit, reinforce my territory, and... You know, keep pushing. All that jazz and such. Great. Actually, probably focusing on. Are you like shit selling something? Might not for... be a bad idea. God, mm. I'm gonna need a lot okay, of guns. I'll wait, for... I'll wait for it to open up, then I'll upgrade all my ships, or at least the more the ones I need. Alrighty, so Romania, we have, well, 10 divisions attacked there. That seems like a lot of guys. Would it be a better to attack more south? No, they have a lot of divisions everywhere. Right, alright, we'll take the major port in the north. Fun fact, when the Germans invaded Romania back in World War One, they went and they basically burned all their wheat fields and their oil fields so the Germans wouldn't have any resources. Uh -huh. Which is actually the sole reason why the Germans went to go help out the Austro-Hungarians with the Romanians. It's because they needed the resources. And, uh, what happened after Romania fell? They got um, some. They got some, yeah. They didn't burn everything because the Romanians Which were like, helped. Well, why and do actually we want to burn? actually kept them in the war longer. Yeah. They were like, why do, you, why do we want to burn everything? Why not just let them have a little bit? But not yeah. a lot, though, because we're allies. <laughs> Not a lot. You can't be too nice now. Yeah, true. <laughs> it's like fucking the Romanians are like, yeah, hey, yo, you see those fires over there? Nah, don't worry about those. <laughs> <laughs> I don't see no fires. You see fires? Nah, man. There ain't no fires there. 34%. How hmm. much is your Democrat? Your Democrat is under 50%. Alright, so that's good. All right, we'll slowly get you fascist. I have, I'm now outnumbered by 50% on my border. So, bro, if you complain. <laughs> You're fine. How many divisions do you have? Okay, so you have like 60 divisions. You can hold a defensive war across the river and just go on the offensive on the river locations. You'll be fine. Oh yeah, yeah, I'm fine defending on the river. I'm not, no arguments there. I'm just, I'm just saying. Besides, like, worst case, if you fall, I can easily take over your territory. I hate you so much right now. 
Let's see, how's actually... How, how overall? Okay, so pause them on everything, cool. Let's go just normal on this stuff, I guess, in the meantime. Well, reinforcements, yes. Upgrades, not so much. There's not really a lot of upgrades I need. Tons of guns and uh, other equipment, so we actually doing pretty good. We need more seaplanes, and then we need tanks for the group. But that'll be the late. That'll be way down the line, so we don't have to worry about that right now. Um, yeah, seaplanes stuff like that. So okay, so here's the plan. Here's the plan. I'm going to I'm going to be fighting the brunt of the army in the south. All right. I currently my men are more superior to them, and they have to cross the river. So I should be massacring them in droves. The only problem is. They do have some tank divisions, but I have arm, but I do have artillery. All right. I don't have any tanks because they don't have oil. And you still haven't done that stupid thing. So, Italy, could you do a march on Rome? Not hard. Go ahead. So, bro, you have military access to me. Do you have any spare divisions on my border? Or... I mean, yeah, I could throw in my twenty-four divisions. Just like what, just like whatever you can spare, just like just a few like divisions. But here I don't there. think I can, I don't think I can put them on your border because we're not allies. Oh, that's true. Okay, I should be fine. Like, like worst case, worst case scenario is I just retreat b b b uh, b uh, behind Constantinople. Yeah, my <laughs> fleet is prepped. Because that works so well versus GTA. My fleet is prepped and ready. Oh, cool. My battleship's done. Awesome. Let's get... Let's get my... Uh... How long will it take to do another battleship? 1.36 years. Okay. How about we focus, instead of on that, we'll focus on two different ships. So how about we focus on... Uh, let's see. Light Cruiser 3000. How much is a Dreadnought? Okay, so how about... Light cruisers. Can we focus on that? Because I kind of actually need a bunch of light cruisers. That would I be helpful. 200 days, which means... That way we have support ships with them. Alright. You go, Slavia, you better be like 36%. Yo, man. 34. Try, God damn, so close to 35. Alright. Let me boost up my uh, political party and I'll boost you some more. Ill famed. Hey, good news guys, they're up to forty two percent. You're really trying to get France. I am desperately trying. <laughs> because let again, if we can get if we can sow some discontent into the allies, yes. I it will work out flawlessly. Flawless. Flawlessly I tell you. So we also I did almost dead I did the math have as well. Three factories. Three the and they're eight, only at 85%. Yeah, they have three damn factories. That's all they have. So there's no way their men are being supplied. They're pro yeah, that's why they're getting torn apart. <laughs> A man can that, dream. That, that's why if you look at the Soviet losses, they're at 6 million men. <laughs> like... It's not I'll good. See. Yeah, it's not... It's not my, my best... Uh... Alright, go on. Yaver, why do you have your men on my border? What? Oh, uh, defense. Why? Because I don't trust you guys since I'm not your ideology yet. Oh my god. We're trying to get you to our... Uh... When I'm your ideology, I remove my men. But in the meantime, <laughs> I do not trust you. Hashtag Entente Life. <laughs> Hashtag Entente. Okay, then. I like how the People's Radical Party is the Democratic Party. <laughs> and the oh, ultra-national- oh my god. I mean, it just makes sense. We Slavs are what... pretty special. <laughs> the, the, the... Okay. Just makes sense. Dude. Yeah. Anyway, I'll get my light cruisers produced. They help support the main fleet. It's gonna go great. Um... <laughs> Because again, I, I kind of want to boost that up so the main fleet has more protection. Because we know they they the the battleship. It's just we need other things. All right. Um. They'll provide fire support. We're about to declare war on them in the next 
month. There's no one protecting it, which is good. And yeah, overall, Romania should hopefully be ours. Now, I'm curious how many men they... Oh, shoot, they have tanks. Well, our fleet support should be able to annihilate them. Mm -hmm. Besides, they're World War I basic light tanks, as we can see by that design. So we're fine. We're fine. How's the United States up? I have a massive amount of artillery. I'm hoping that just is able to just... Wait, Woodrow Wilson is still... President, yeah. Huh. He was. He should be next election, 1924. Yeah, because 1916 was the election Woodrow Wilson got. Because it was the election of, is the United States going to war? Teddy Roosevelt was for the war. Woodrow Wilson was against it. And there was another gentleman that was, like, in the middle. And, uh, I think... And, and uh, Wilson won, but he had he eventually went into the war. Yeah, but again, it was like a uh, circumstance where it's like, okay, Zimmerman after, note. After Allied Wilson, shipping it blown was. Up. Uh, after Wilson, it was. Also, I love the idea of Germany. Like, hey, just in case the United States goes to war, we can beat France before that happens. No. You're in tw in what 1917. Your entire strategy was play defensive. Am I wrong? Yep. So what? They tried. They tried attacking the French a lot because they thought the French were weak, and then the French were like, "Yeah, lol, no." <laughs> well, they they were like they, they were. Yeah, but not as the British like, support is what saved them. Yeah. Oh, uh, eh. Well, then the Doughboys came in and it, saved look, them from ever movies. done. The reason why that Verdun failed is because of the fact that German reinforcements that are going to Verdun instead went to, uh, was it, the Battle of the Somme, which pushed slightly more uh, into German territory while the Verdun was, pu you know, that whole thing happened. It was, uh, both of them were, weren't exa they were mixed bags. They just depleted resources, essentially. Just didn't work out, man. Just, just didn't work out. <laughs> Yeah. Um, let's see, it should be about so good to go to war against Romania. They are not protected by anyone, which is good. God. Uh, come on. They Tech faster. Fleet? Okay, they have seven ships. I should easily annihilate them. Wait, do they have any planes? They have no planes. Okay, I should easily be able to annihilate them. How's my industry? Alright, going better. Should be just fine with. Come on, there we go. Justification of war. And declare got... war. Hello, fleet battle. Be my newly made battleship and battle cruisers, and light cruisers and destroyers and submarines. Oh my. I have a basic. Air. I've got the shittiest air fleet. Send my fleet in the meantime. Uh, Send your air force there. Hello. As well. There go some of their destroyers. You're saying they were to the advance? Okay, I can attack now. Do you want me to? I, what, what or do you, you want me to? Do you like? Do you want me to just declare war on them now, or do you want me to wait till you take the port? The the choice is yours. Oh, okay, yeah. I guess I'll I guess I'll distract them now. I'm waiting my naval incursion. If that's your question, I just unfortunately don't have a uh, an air base, which I should have probably made. Let me quickly make that. Again, if you're wondering, like, oh, great shot, what are you doing? Okay, make the air base so that my planes can support, and make sure we don't get annihilated. Vaccine campaign, cool. Let's defeat the Spanish flu. And, uh, let's, 1936, all right. Okay, well, let's see how this war is coming along. I've killed 80,000 Romanians. I appreciate it. Just oh. keep on murdering. Let's see. Okay. 
trying to see if they're any closer. Still 85%. And the Soviets... Yeah. Alright, let's ignore them for now. We got our own war to win. So, how many... So, it's... How many divisions? F three divisions of mine versus five. 21,000 manpower with 36,000 manpower. No art Oh, right. No artillery. Are you si Yeah, I was going to say. There's no way. My main battle fleet has them in the bag. I guess let's send this up here. Oh, cool. Yeah, I can send it this way. Wait, that Zeppelin... Wait, a Zeppelin won't do anything on open water. I mean, it'll scouting, yes, but not for... Missing equipment. Oh, whatever. Okay, ground support. There you go, 151. You should have air supremacy now. Yeah, it's helping. I've also drained most of the supply sector, which is also a plus. That's good. I think. Also, I keep annihilating them in the water, which is also fantastic. Slowly winning the ground battle and the naval invasion. Uh, do you want to know how many men I've killed? Sure, give me an estimate. I've killed 300,000 Romanians. God damn. I've <laughs> killed... Not, and I'm just going to keep none. waiting because I've got a lot more... Jesus Christ. How are you murdering them so much? Because I have nothing but artillery. That was my whole freaking goal. <laughs> just to drain them fucking dry of men and guns because there's no way they can train that many to weapons that quickly. There's n There was just no way. Well, alright then. So, what's left of their tiny little fleet? A couple... A light cruiser and destroyer is trying to counteract, but they have yet to damage a single ship. I'm Hundreds just hitting of them thousands. At range. Hundreds of thousands of Romanians have tried to cross this, and I have murdered them all. <laughs> well, I'm so happy for you, seriously. Thank you. I knew you would be. Jesus. I keep looking back at Russia and being like, is anything changing? It's like, nope, they keep advancing, but it's no closer to capitulating. I've lost 13,000 men, Romania has lost 400,000. Wow, sounds like the French first days in World War I. Or the <laughs> Austrian-Hungarians winter campaign in the early part of the war. Damn, that was a genius strategy. Go but, Conrad von Hotzendorf. <laughs> but guys, I want to launch a winter campaign in mountains. It's a great strategy. What's the worst that can happen? Yeah. Let's see. My guy should be able to land shortly. Looks like, again, you're pushing up the waterway. Yep. Who is this? A Field Marshal Clement Bodalskit. Bodashev. Alright. Are you going to land anytime sooner? These guys are heavily depleted in organization. I should land shortly. I'm looking at their guys. They have a very low organization. Uh, their strength is... It's what happens when... I, I'm not going to lie, bro. If you look at their supplies right now, they are all drained. Because they literally threw everything they had at me in a massive attack. Wait, and it was how, just like... Why, wait, where do you see supplies at? I'm actually curious. Are you just looking at their organization or guns? I'm looking at their... Um... Looking at their their average strength is nine percent of what it should be because they're they're oh. just yeah their strength of the guys I'm fighting are really low. Uh, naval penalty again. And... I killed four hundred thousand Romanians. I'm doing better. I'm doing. Uh, listen, listen. The Romanians have pulled a Yaver. That's what they've done. Oh. I landed. You landed. Okay. Oh. I see. The British Rosh has like 350 divisions. I'm attacking. All 
I'm gonna push my men and then once they gain a little bit more territory, I'll begin my landing. But I, do, I don't want it there just in case they push them back and push me into the port. Because mm -hmm. my guys will be really low. So. Oh, wow. Yep. Wow, how many divisions do they have again? They have 30. What the fuck happened to all of them? Remember when I murdered them all? Oh, wow. <laughs> I've killed 450,000 Romanians. I mean... Romania's they tried. trying. They, they tried. Wow, this was a lot easier than I had suspected. Yeah, I was expecting this brutal, hard campaign. Fight for the ages. I lost kind 15, of testing I lost 15,000 men. Wow. Yeah, they, they just lost all their divisions. That's literally what happened. They had hundreds of divisions, and I murdered Dude, them all. Both, look, my troops don't even have to go there. <gasps> yeah, I thought this would be a lot bloodier of the war. This. Are you... <laughs> okay, then. So, wow, bro, how, we, how, we do we, how do we want to split this? I'm guessing I'm going to be taking... Mm. Okay, so I feel like... Bucharest is fine. Uh, where is all the resources located? Okay, anyway, how about... Alright, so it's my turn? Alright. Mm -hmm. Oh, damn it. So it's only that? I took everything on the outskirts, so I figured you'd oh, want something on the coast. Pass. There you go. Pass. Okay, so what do you not want? Uh, can I have... Like, what states do you want? I, I kind of want half of the Mutini region, but I guess I can't get that. Yeah, that's all or nothing. Damn it. And I, I, I know you want that, but do you mind if I take either that or... Because I kind of want the ports and the, the resources from it. Uh, how about... How about I take... How about I take Romania? And we'll split up, we'll split Ukraine. So that way you can have that coastal region. Because hmm. you, you can click there and you can tell it's all you can, you know what I mean? But Yugoslavia is protecting it. Yavert, yeah, can you unguarantee Ukraine? I cannot. <laughs> Ukraine is my son. I've bred it to where it is to be today. Alright, how about this? We both kill Yugoslavia so we can take Ukraine. <laughs> do it. <laughs> um, okay, so bro, seriously, wh uh, what parts do you want? Alright, so Ukraine is something that apparently he wants to keep. So I'll take, how about this? I'll take Bessabia. How about that? The Bessarabia? Yeah, Bessarabia. So if I'll take Mutenia, then you have the three in the top? Yeah, sure. So I take this and you have the rest? Yeah, uh, so let me pass for a moment. Pass okay. again, please. There you go. Okay, so... Oh, yeah, oh, I know exactly what I'm doing. And oh, then... you're gonna be it. I, you're gonna... <laughs> Romania is still alive, everybody. Just in case you were wondering, Romania <laughs> is still alive. You're a dick. You can see them right there. They're guys, still okay. Guys, like, they're right there. You can clearly see them. They're, they're a okay. The British are just like, the hell? <laughs> they're alive, guys. I see them. <laughs> Oh my god, I don't need resources anymore! Oh my god, I got oil! I have freaking do I, oil! Do I have more production? Okay, I have a little more production now, I'll take it. All right. I actually have factories! It's so wonderful! Yeah. So Yavert. So Yavert. <laughs> yes. Uh... Okay. How much do the, uh, how, what are you at? You're at 34% fascist. Yes. 
Hold on, let me try something. I'm gonna start boosting my communism. I'm gonna watch the fascism. Shit, 34.6. Thirty point three. Yeah, it's going down like shit. Why does it go down against fascism? It doesn't make any sense. It should take a. Uh, I guess it's four out of fascism and one out of democrat. Eh, no, it's not worth it. Um, who can I go after next? What one do you five think? One. Yes. Poland. Or you could go after Hungary. See, right now I'm actually kind of disappointed because, yeah, I guess I could go after Hungary. Yeah, but do you mind if I go after Hungary? Do it. You don't mind? Do it. Okay. Just a fine war. I feel the same. Wait, Poland is improving relations. Yeah, Listen, they're bro, authoritarian. You should, you should go after you, uh, or no? Yeah, Ukraine isn't. No, no. Keep telling me. What should I go after? Damn it! I'm actually kind. Of, I shouldn't have given you that, honestly, because that kind of stops my natural growth. What? What? Like, what? How does that stop your natural growth exactly? Because it. Uh, you what? Uh, Ukraine. Uh. Uh, you just said you're not gonna get it. Uh, uh, France or Germany is now going and canceling all of the public of the non yeah, they're doing with that. everyone. Uh, oh, uh, whatever. Yeah, There's fascism for you. Um, good old fascism. I feel. Where where are the rest of my men? Wait, seriously, where the frick are they? Oh, oh. Wow, Hungary is like no man. Oh, they're there. Okay. Like, what? Oh, Yavert, Yavert, Yavert. If I... Okay, I'm going to conquer northern Hungary. And, uh... Alfold. You can take over Transdanubia, okay? Uh-oh. What? I don't know. Oh, no, what I'm saying is... Okay, here's the plan. Because you're going to be taking over, once you become fascist, you can take over Transdubia, which is like the western portion yes. of Hungary. And uh, after that, I'll take over Czechoslovakia in this region, like the southern region, so that way it's all connected. And you can have Austria, northern Czech, like the western Czech and western Hungary. Oh. Okay. Because, you know, why not? I'm just saying it works out, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so my next goal is to fight Poland. That's going to be probably one hell of an undertaking. Am I wrong? Mm, you're, yeah, that, you're not wrong. I thought you were going to go after the uh, Italian state. Oh, they're still in the, in the Entente. Yeah. Oh my god, they're still fighting Russia. Yeah, that's still a thing. I forgot about that. I was like, oh, yeah. Like, God damn it, Russia. Just die already. Russia's like, nope. Hold my beer. I'm still fighting. And, like, Russia's on the ground. There's blood everywhere. They're they have 86%. two broken arms. 86. Anyway, my men are prepped and ready. God. How many men? How many of the Romanians did you kill, by the way? Honestly? Yes. Uh. Not a ton. It kind of felt like I was, it was shooting fish in a barrel. Because there was like hundreds of thousands. And the artillery is just opening fire. Like doo, 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 doo. It's like raining shells on them. Yeah. <laughs> Let me put it like this. It wasn't. It wasn't very humane. But it worked. <laughs> anyway, my goal is very simple. My goal is to push into uh, Poland. Effectively. How well is that going to go? 
I don't Probably know. Not. But I could use the factories. And also, yeah, uh, pretty much that. Just a fine That's thing. not to say that Poland won't be there, but I'm just saying, like, I need to naturally you, expand. You do realize that... I could take Lithuania, Latvia, and uh, all How? the rest. Like, that is a massive undertaking. <laughs> yep, and the Greeks are more than willing. Plus, then we just sandwich the Bulgarians, and it works. What? Uh, I'm sorry, what? <laughs> That's what I thought. Anyway, moving. Oh, wow, they are gaining aircraft fast. All right. Keep working on that aircraft, Greece. You're doing great. I mean, if you take over that... Boy, your state is just weird. <laughs> like... Thank you. I mean that in the nicest way. God, I'm so close. I'm at 43.5%. Uh, so close yet so far. I'll have to wait till I get to like 450 before I... Well, actually, no. I have to wait till 600 exactly. Which the big be... thing is is kind of just depleting the... The Polish nation. Hopefully. I killed 400,000 Romanians. 400... Thousand. <laughs> You're... I mean, you know, hopefully I can do that against the Polish. Again, my natural expansion would have been Italy if it wasn't for them still being in the Entente. The, the Entente. Because we all know they would have been fascist by this point. Uh-huh. So, like, the Balkan League needs to expand. And right now, as much as I want to expand cleanly, I kind of have to expand kind of annoyingly up north. Annoyingly up north. Oh yeah, God, I am. Um, that I literally burned through. Yep, I used all of my air support. But they had no all planes. The, well, see, that was the thing. In the initial attack, I had air superiority, basically because I had like five zeppelins, a few scout planes. Oh, you can imagine I wasted hundred... all of it. Yeah, I just bombed that. Cause, I mean, it was Romania. Hundreds of thousands of men. And literally, it was I blew them to hell. You're... And back again, thank you. Wait. Wait. Gavert! What? You're supporting dem democracy in France? No, I'm not. Yes, you are. I'm looking no, at you. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Yeah, no, the I only thing see... that's being boosted is my ultra-nationalists in Greece. You just stopped it. I, I saw it. I saw what? it. Why would and I I'll... do something like that? Because I don't you... know. You, because you tell us. He... Because Yavert is secretly going with the Entente. No. I'm... This is Balkan League for a reason, right? It He's is. See... That's why he doesn't want us to fight Ukraine. He wants an ally. He doesn't want us to take Russia and a fascist friend. Oh my god, it's making sense now. What? I'm gonna double down in Poland. I need to. I need to get those factories. And all those supplies. Because look there. at all those supplies. I need the wood. Hey, right, yeah, but listen. We're not the one. You could have been attacking by now. I decided not to go the communist route. Which is surprisingly I didn't not. realize. I didn't. I did realize. I guess. I don't know. I did. I accidentally realize. went. Com I did accidentally meant went communist menace. Oh. <laughs> oh, I have a tech tree option that I really like. What? We'll see. Did you finally get something that would actually push you in a certain direction? No, uh, I wish. Something. Great. Well, in the meantime, I'm going to prep my army for an invasion of Poland, which essentially is, hey, defend yourself until the Polish are weak, then push. Yeah, good strategy. I wonder who taught you that one, not the Bulgarians. 
you know? Bulgarians took the seven years of si or was it seven? It, or I guess six. Six years of peace and then demonstrated to the world Dude, the might. Does Poland have a navy at all? Okay, they have no navy. Cool. God, no. God, look at the Polish leader right now. He looks like he wants to murder me. Yeah, I've, he was kind of an asshole, too. <laughs> It wasn't that nice of a guy. Oh. Oh my. Air innovations. Alright, so I hope after this, they do the march on Rome. Wait. Oh no, he can't do it! Because he's at war! God. Once again, the Soviet Union just messes with it. So we can't do it until the war is over. So until the Soviet Union falls, Italy's not falling. Wait, wait, wait. The March on Rome. Is that actual tech thing? Yes. Oh, it is. That's what I keep saying. There are 86%, meaning we need Russia to die. To be fair, that's the, also the same thing with France. Because if you look at France, there's <sighs> a... Uh, oh, there are crisis. Yeah, Whatever. Yeah. I'll take the Baltic states in the meantime. I'll go over there again. There's the Allied occupation of the Rhineland. And then there's Les Foles or occupation of Ruber. Which is gain to po popularity of democratic 20%. You are 37%, Yavert. I'm slowly getting you up there. That's fine. That's, I'm gonna that's go fine. finish off Russia. Thank you. <laughs> Please kill it with fire. But yeah, but why would you decrease the? Why would you decrease or increase democrat democracy in France? Uncured why would you accuse me of such a crime? Because I saw you. I saw it. I would never do anything like that. Don't you accuse? Yeah, accuse. A cruise. Don't you say a Of a heinous, of a heinous crime against humanity. I yes, don't accuse him of anything. He didn't do it. He's innocent. Shame on you. Shame on you for thinking I would do something like that. Yeah, for shame, 151, for shame. Yeah, I see that little evil mustache of yours. I, see I would it. never, I would never do anything to hurt our alliance. Yay! I got one additional division by the Legionary Romanians. There's a reason why I'm going and finishing up Russia for you guys. B because you want to focus on us? No, why would I do that? Because you want to win. <laughs> you want oh. to say, you want to say Yugoslavia won the Balkan. I, no, I already won. I've, I've already beaten Austria-Hungaria. I've accomplished my goals. No, you're not. Your goal is to reclaim all the Austria-Hungarian pieces under a Yugoslavian border. That's the no. ultimate Serbian goal. Oh my god. Oh my god. Actually, now thinking about it, you should split. Okay. So Yavrik goes fascist, right? Okay. Right? right? Go, with, go with me here. Go with me here. Yavert attacks. I okay. I take Hungary, and I take the Czech, like the Czech region. Yavert gets Western Hungary, Austria, and then we uh the, the 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 Prague, and then he takes like Northern Italy, and like bro, you take the rest of it. Okay. So you the Mediterranean will be your pawns. Because at that point, the only one, the only major powers, well, yeah, the French and the uh, UK. Yeah, no offense, I can't fight France. You could if you had the, if you you could if you had the naval ports of Italy. That's true, but they have a stronger navy, a stronger army, and a stronger air force than I could ever achieve right now. So no. Sounds like not my problem. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like definitely your problem because, it, once again, if by chance they were like, hey. Maybe we should go annihilate them. I would not be able to do a damn thing. Yavert, you're boosting them. No, I'm not. Why I'm would you it right now? Recording. No, I would never. No, 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 no. You're wrong. You got it all wrong. Oh, I would you just never stopped. do anything you like that. You just stopped. I would never do anything like that. Again, how dare you accuse me of such a heinous crime? You son of a bitch. I would I'm never. Trying to get you I would never, so I would never do anything like that. How dare you accuse me of such a thing? <laughs>
The fact you're lying to me so much. Look, well, I'm, I'm next helping you're gonna you guys. say your I'm mom ending didn't the war. I'm ending the war in Russia, so you can declare war in Italy. I'm helping yeah, Bert. you. Yeah, but next but, th next thing you're gonna say is your mom didn't die in Vietnam. No, she did die in Vietnam. I would never lie to you guys. He's lying to us. No, he, why would he's you? He's lying to. Definitely yeah, about this, not about his mom. Yeah, but there's only one reason to why why it's because you're gonna backstab us. That's the only no, reason. No, I would not. I'm not. No. <laughs> yep. How dare you think that of me? Why and would I do something like that? Because you're you. You do this no. all the time. Oh my god! Don't you dare accuse that of me. I would never do that. Uh -huh. How dare you? He's he's. He, you know what? I might just take all of Hungary just because I I fear the yeah. Why? What did I do? Because you're lying to us. I'm not lying to anyone. Really? You, have such a you guys are lying. Voice. You guys are lying to yourselves. I have a high pitched voice because I'm surprised that you guys would even think of this. By the way, I just want to make note. My brother literally has a recording. So, like. I. It doesn't. I. It's not. No. It's fake news. I'm. It's fake no. news. I'm still okay. trying to get I'm you back ending the war. I'm tempted. No, I'm, I, I, I'm doing nothing wrong. Do you have revolutionaries yet? No, no I don't. God damn it, you're nearly I don't think I'll ever have any. Percent. Look look how much of a push I made in Russia. Look at this. Look at down south. You're not fighting anyone! Yes, I am. I have my entire army up on the border. Oh yeah, okay. you probably can't see it, can you? No, no. I can't. No, okay. That's fine. <laughs> All you need to know is that this is me. I'm doing this. Look, Soviet Union's at 80% percent, so if... They, if the town of uh, Tashkent falls, they'll probably be at ninety percent, which is so incredibly stupid that that what like there's no other city. Like I'm looking through, what other city is there? I'm looking, I'm looking all over. Give me a city. Give me any city. There's, there's no. City. I got a question. Why would he? Yaver is stopping. Anyway. I'm gonna focus on Poland. You get your shit together. And then eventually I'll start my heavy armor divisions. Cause you know, heavy armor. Amazing armor. The best armor in the game. So, have those going. Should be totally fine. Boring. No, yeah. Yavert's been lying to us, which means maybe I do. Are I we sure not. GTA? Are we sure GTA is not in this game and they're secretly ally aligned? Not doing such a thing. Huh. I mean, guys, he's saying he's, he's not doing it, so of course we know he he, he means it. Yeah, exactly. You're we right. Know Thank you. Finally, you understand. Let's see. Escort of tactical bomber. Uh, fighter detection. Strategic bomber. Ground support. Let's do. So yeah, let's do that. And uh, infantry weapons. Let's get that going. Let's see. But well, it's should... rather quiet. How are you losing to the Soviets, if that's the case? How are you not breezing by them? Uh, they have 30 divisions in one hangar. Never mind. What are they actually up to, the Soviet? They're at 88% towards capitulation. I mean, dear lord. I mean, congratulations on the... On the, the There's the, uh... not much of them left. Congratulations on the the admiral for finally winning the war for the uh, but I don't think this is any of the white movement anymore. I think this is just radicals fighting radicals. I mean, to be fair, look at if we look at the losses, we have six oh, million. Oh, almost men. forgot about that. Yeah, so they have six million losses, and plus the other one seven million. Yeah, we've lost a thousand men. <laughs> Damn it. Is 
He's at 88 per uh, nearly 39 percent. All right. I wouldn't. Submarine. That's all carrier protection. <gasps> oh my god. Bro, stop boosting Yavert. I know his plan. What? He wants you to become fascist. He wants you to boost him to fascism. Yeah, then once so. he's fascist, he has all of the aligned with him. All of the aligned? All the he aligned. He has the entire attente. Okay. Yeah. So, if he declares war, and he's in their faction... He would lose. He would basically have the French, the British, the well, maybe not the Italians, um, but the major European powers all flood in to attack. No, us. Yavert's our friend. He wouldn't do that. He lied to us. Why would I do something like that to you guys? Because, no, because there's no benefit. Yes, there is. Yeah, there is, indeed. You're gonna be like, well, it's for the sake of the video. It would have been boring just us conquering no. the world, but now I'm the winner. No, I would not do anything Let's like be that. very it's clear right weird. now. We are not conquering... Never, yes, we conquered never, Romania, have... and I may try to invade Poland, but God knows how that's gonna go. I and have never Hungary is a different done... story. They have nothing, so, yeah, you're getting free territory, because, you know, you're lucky like that. I would never do anything of the sort. Uh-huh. I'm surprised you would even think that low of me. I I don't think that low of you. I think that highly of you that you would. I think that I think I. I, I think, think you're that manipulative. <laughs> I am not doing anything wrong. I he's, have not. I have not, not proven he's not my He's not denied it, which is the. Scary I've supported part. you guys throughout everything that you have done, and I am so honestly, genuinely surprised that you guys think this low of me. Guys, I am so. Shocked. Then that why you are you boosting France again? I'm not boosting France. Check France. Or now I'm telling not. you. I, I did that to test you and you passed that time, but still. I'm telling you. You you're you're baffling yourself. You're baffling. Mm -hmm. Well I'm gonna all baffle right. I'm gonna baffle myself all the way to the victory stadium. I... One five one. Listen, listen. Just no. I, do, I know just what I'm no. saying. I'm just I'm gonna baffle my really. That's your comeback. That's your incredible comeback. I didn't. I never said it was incredible. I never said that. I never implied it either. Okay. So in the meantime, I think that's a good place to end it. I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed our assault on Romania. Tune in next time to hopefully. The Soviet Union gets put out of its damn misery. And, uh, yeah, I, I launch an assault into Poland. We'll see how well that goes. Probably not well, but we, we, we hopefully it goes well. You know, I want it to go well. I really do. Wow, I just realized that guy looks very similar to a person I know. In any case, thanks for watching. And, uh, th this is Grayshot17, Grayshot151, and Yavert. And we'll see you guys next time. Later, guys. Later, dudes.